Yo guys, and welcome back to Fortnite Pro Player Updates. Today's video will be featuring Jarvis. We'll be taking a look at his Fortnite settings, controller binds, and setup. For those that have not heard of Jarvis, here's a clip of him eliminating a well-known duo, NRG Mr. Savage M and Benji Fishy. Just throw your stinks out. That's what I'm trying to do. Yeah. Right there, so. Nice, nice, nice. Just throw your stinks, just fish your stinks. You get tagged. Yeah, nice, nice, nice. Nice. Yeah, he's gonna die, he's gonna die. Smoke, get up. Nice. Just play it out. You got it, zone's closing in. I'll leave all of Jarvis's links below so you guys can go check him out. Now, let's start off with his Fortnite settings. So for Jarvis's video settings, he was playing on 1511 by 1080 stretched res. However, he can no longer play this and now has to play native as it's required by Epic Games for Fortnite competitive play. If you guys want to know more about this, I'll leave my video linked below. Jarvis has the sprint by default option turned on. This allows him to sprint without having to press or hold a specific button to sprint. These are all of Jarvis's controller binds and dead zone settings. These are all of Jarvis's peripherals. For Jarvis's controller, he's using the Xbox Elite wireless controller in white with two paddles attached to the back left of it. The top left paddle is bound to RB, his floor bind, and the bottom left paddle is bound to LB, which is his roof bind. The thumbsticks on his controller are just the default ones. No control freaks are attached. Also, Jarvis holds his controller using the right hand claw grip. His monitor is the Asus VG248QE, 24-inch, 144Hz refresh rate. His headset is the HyperX Cloud 2s in silver. His mic is the Audio-Technica AT2020 Plus USB. His webcam is the Logitech Brio. And his gaming chair is the Quersus G702. That's all for Jarvis's peripherals. Now, let's take a look at his PC specs. And yeah guys, that's all i got for today regarding Jarvis. Be sure to drop a like on the video and subscribe if you're new to my channel. Also guys, remember to have someone's supporter creator code selected in the Fortnite item shop. It can be Jarvis, BTW, Code Life, or any other creator's code. It's worth having someone's code locked in guys as it's a super easy way to help out your favourite creators. And yeah guys, thanks for watching. Peace.